Oh my goodness, my friends. Welcome back to the Makers Gonna Learn YouTube channel. My name's Tanner and y'all, we just got back from the Dollar Tree and I promise you by the end of this video, you are never gonna think of the Dollar Tree the same again. I cannot believe what they have done, right? I'm really impressed with a lot of these and I think you guys are going to be as well. Um, but this changes the game for Dollar Tree. Like a crafter and Dollar Tree, like practically best friends. I'm so excited for this haul today because we have some really, really impressive items that I am dying to share with you. So we're gonna go ahead and jump right in. But before we do, if you love Dollar Tree, if you love Cricut, go ahead and stamp that subscribe button, give the video a thumbs up because I know you're gonna enjoy today's haul video. I'm gonna give lots of inspiration. I'm gonna share with you what we plan to do with a lot of these projects. And I cannot wait to see what you find at the Dollar Tree. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. First up, guys, $5 for this chalkboard. Okay, now you may be saying, Tanner, it's a chalkboard. What's exciting about this? Guys, it's a 23 inch by 17 inch chalkboard. You can do so many different things with these blanks and they're only $5. $5, is that not crazy? I plan on doing Christmas decor on the board, a big Christmas quote. This could take up a lot of space on my mantle, on my fireplace, you know, all of the things like that, that I do, I could use this for. Recently, Lauren was able to make a really fun project for the first day of school. Let me grab it for you. All right, so I quickly grabbed this one just because I wanted to show you. Yes, it's a little bit bigger, but you could easily size this first day of school project down and put it on the $5 board. And heck, it would probably be even easier for your kid to hold. And this one right here um, retails full price $70 from Hobby Lobby. Chances are you're getting it 50% off, but still, $5, like this is not something you wanna you know, pass up. You wanna go ahead and pick up some of these at the Dollar Tree at, on your next visit if your store has them because I think you'll be really, really impressed with the chalkboards, okay? So that's number one. This is one that I'm super, super, super excited for. I think you all will be too. Um, you could stencil on here with chalk. You could just add vinyl. That's what I plan on doing, so I'm really excited. Now over to this side, I was equally excited to see this. So this is a sign that's also $5. They call it this the horizontal sign, but here's what we plan on doing with it. We plan on painting this black and then doing some of this action. You guys know I'm obsessed with doing these by the front door. Um, and this is gonna be an affordable one that we all can make really quick without having to go to the home improvement store, without having to get a really heavy piece of wood, you're gonna have a door porch sign, really affordable and really fast. So we're gonna actually take that. This is actually one of my favorite tips. If you guys see blanks that are affordable, but they already have like text on it, guess what? You paint it up and then you have whatever you want, which I think is really impressive. So, all right, that's blank number two. Now, are you all excited to go through some of these bags? Let's go ahead and start over here and kind of take a look at what we got. So this was $5, this was $5. Let's see how much the rest of these are. So first up, we have this pillow, which is actually a really comfortable, like nice pillow. I'm telling you, again, the Dollar Tree is never gonna be the same. This one was $5 again. So the Dollar Tree is no more Everything's a dollar. It's like everything's $3, $5. These are some really high quality blanks. So I just wanna disclose they are more expensive, but I think you're really getting a great value. For example, maybe this pillow at Walmart would be $8, right? There's possibility there. So you get a pillow, you can actually use heat transfer vinyl on an already stuffed pillow. You could do it really easy. I have videos on it, so definitely check those out if you're interested. It's really, really simple. So that's awesome. Next up, <clears throat> this is a $5 pizza pan. Now this is a 16 inch pizza pan. For example, the previous ones they sold, I believe was 10 to 12 inches um, and they were just really small. So this one feels like really good quality. So I think you all will be very, very happy with this pan. So we're using this at our upcoming year member summit. 
So if you're attending, go ahead and grab one of these because you'll be really impressed with what we do with it. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at our next bag. Oh my gosh, you guys are gonna be super excited for these. These are the stainless steel tumblers. You guys know we've etched these, we add vinyl to these, so many. Now this one's $5 and this is a, I'm trying to see, it's a 20 ounce. So it's not 16, it's not 24, it's a 20 ounce, not super common, but I actually like the size. And then this next one, when I saw this, I was like, where are we at? Like, I just didn't feel like the Dollar Tree, which is crazy. This one is a wooden wall organizer. It's $5. And guys, it has the cork board. It has the wood. I want to add some really fun things on the cork, cut out with the Cricut, and then maybe paint it. I think it would be really fun. I was trying to see how easy it would be to maybe pop out the cork. It doesn't seem that easy, so I may have to tape it off or something when I'm painting, which is still fun. All right. This next bag, what we've got is, dun dun dun, dun This is a blanket. So this is a $5 fleece throw, um, 50 by 60 inches, again for $5. And this is just a really great fleece blanket. You guys know we do a lot of projects with these. So it's nice to have on hand, super awesome. And then this is another wooden blank. Look at this. I mean, this is something like, they're trying to compete with Hobby Lobby. And you guys know my Hobby Lobby and Dollar Tree's right next to each other. I'm, I'm gonna have to start going to Dollar Tree first before even thinking about going to Hobby Lobby, which is crazy. So $5, you get this hanging board with hooks. And again, this would be really fun to do as a chore chart. This would be really fun for an entryway. Keep your keys, keep your piece of chalk. Super awesome. I think you all will be really impressed with this one as well. Love that. And then over in this bag, I mean, the goodness just keeps on going. The wooden blank selection here is absolutely incredible. So what I mean by that, they're literally coming for Hobby Lobby and Michaels. This is another $5 wood plaque. And this is a whole new shape. They have kind of taken the normal rectangle and kind of made it a little bit more round, which I find very elegant. I could do this for so many fun projects, paint it, add heat transfer vinyl, add vinyl. You guys will be really impressed with this one. And then next up, they have the circle round. These are another one of my favorites. These are $5. Um, so some of these basic ones, I don't know if I could find cheaper at Michael's or Hobby Lobby, it depends. Um, but it's nice to have the option to grab at Dollar Tree. Next up, I really love this bamboo cutting board. Now, there's so many things to do with it for Cricut, but I really love bamboo to use in my laser cutter. So my Glowforge, really nice to be able to etch and do all sorts of fun things with the bamboo. Um, so you could actually engrave this, etch it, things like that. Um, in a laser, you could actually, you know, still um, do some wood burning with the Cricut in these. This one's really big. This is a, um, I wonder what size this is. It's, it's a really large one, so I'm really impressed with that. I think you all will too. You'd actually mix some of these together for some wall decor, for some holiday decor, and things like that. Then, last but not least, they have my favorite type of wooden tray. So this is a $5 wooden tray. I love these, absolutely love these. You can paint this, you could add vinyl to it, and then you can do a resin project to seal this in and have a really high quality look. But for $5, you got this at the Dollar Tree. So this is what I mean, like you're never gonna think of the Dollar Tree the same again, am I right? I want you to right now in the comments, so drop me a comment and tell me what you're most looking forward to purchasing, looking at, testing out for yourself. We're gonna feature a lot of these in upcoming videos to let you guys get some inspiration of more Dollar Tree craft ideas. And I'm super excited for these, kind of this new like Dollar Tree initiative, even though prices have went up, I'm excited to see that there's some things that will still save me money and I think you all will be really excited about as well. So go ahead, leave me a comment, give the video a thumbs up. If you're looking for a place to master your Cricut machine, 
or you're ready to join our membership, check that out at the first link down below. Subscribe for more DIY Dollar Tree videos, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.